Holy love versus self-love. Let's take a look. Self-love is motivated towards self-advantage in thought, word, and deed. Holy love is motivated in every thought, word, and action by love of God and neighbor as self. Self-love sees only others' faults, not his own, considers himself on the right path, perhaps even humble and virtuous. Holy love sees himself full of imperfections, is always seeking to be perfected through love, considers everyone more humble and holy than himself. Self-love <clears throat> holds a checklist in his heart of every wrong perpetuated against him. Holy love imitates divine mercy as best he can, is compassionate and forgiving. Self-love is quick to anger and stands vigil over his own rights, making certain they are not transgressed. Uh, holy love is patient, takes note of others' needs and concerns. Self-love hangs on to his own opinions, refusing to surrender to another viewpoint. Holy love offers his own opinions but listens to others and lends them equal merit with his own. Self-love takes pride in his own achievements, may even take pride in his own spiritual progress. Holy love realizes all things proceed from God, that without God he is capable of nothing, no good thing. All good comes from grace. Self-love sees himself in the world as the be-all and all. His only pleasure in is thus achieved through the world. Holy love takes joy in storing up heavenly treasure, in growing closer to God and deeper in holiness. Knows the difference between earthly pleasures and spiritual joy. Self-love uses the goods of the world to satisfy self. Holy love uses the goods of the world to satisfy quests for holiness. Self-love object, objects to every cross, sees trials as a curse, resents others' good fortunes. Hmm. Holy love surrenders to the cross through love as Jesus did, sees crosses as a grace to be used to convert others. Self-love prays only for himself and his own needs. Holy love prays for all in need. Self-love cannot accept God's will, becomes bitter over trials. Holy love accepts God's will with a loving heart, even when difficult.